An area is the class monitor for the first batch of students of the long-term caregiver classes for Filipinos in TCUST. She's from Armok City and is 20 years old this year. She's a teaching who lives in the Great Love Village back home and has been active in many volunteer activities. Let's take a look at her story. E er san si wu I am from Armok City, Philippines. So we are six in my family. Our house is it's just a small normal house like in the Philippines. It's where we usually spend our weekends. Because when we were kids, my mom always told me that, that you should study. The Philippines was struck by Typhoon Hyena on November 8th. The maximum wind speed at that time was 375 kilometers per hour, which set a new record. A volunteer became a familiar figure appearing on the largest television station in the Philippines, ABS-CBN, to give a report. Local reports include news of Taiwan NGO organization providing relief funds for affected residents, including a cash for work campaign. <laughs> The minimum wage here is only about 5 US dollars, but we give 10 US dollars. So this is more than double, as you can see, they are all very happy. So I was 13 years old then when Typhoon Haiyan came, and I was really scared because we can hear the wind blowing and then the roofs of the houses. We can really hear how it flew away and then then the rain, it was oh, it was not really raining hard but the wind was too strong that we can feel it that the roofs of our houses came flying. I came to see how hard life is so it, it, was, it was on my mind that I really need to study hard to help my family because it was indeed a disaster. The first time I saw Chuchi, the first thing that came into my mind is that they they really help people in need and that they don't wait for others to help us. They really hands on. They really hands on. They never wait for the government's permission to permission to give us what we need, and they never expect anything in return. They just help us anything. Chuchi taught us that if we wanted change, we needed to work. Especially now when we're most troubled, only your team is here to help us. All citizens of Tacloban are very grateful to the city foundation. With your presence, at least para kami nabuhayan. We moved to the Taai village. I saw that Suchi has like a, a lot of um, like branches, like they just don't give us financially and then the things they also have spiritually and then they were also um, teaching us how to like how to be filial with the family. <laughs> 